welcome to our channel MD16. And today my name is Gan Juhan and this is My name is Mama Pekal. And my name is Kobina. Today we are going to do about Now we are going to discuss this question. The amount of grains packed in the sack is normally distributed with mean weight, mu and standard deviation 6 kg. Given the probability x is less than 24 equals to 0.1587. The sack is separated from others if it weighs less than 25 kg. Hey, good morning guys. Okay, today we are going to discuss about the chapter 10 special probability distribution. Question A. Find the value of u. We know that normally distribute with mean of u and standard deviation of 6 kg okay now write down the information that we know x is normally distribute with a mean and standard deviation of 6 kg okay this is variance so standard deviation we know that is 6 kg so we have to put a square there okay we also know that p x less than 24 is equals to 0 0.1587 okay now you want to find the value of mean okay now we standardize the x first p standardize x equals to 24 minus mean over 6 over the standard deviation okay equals to 0 0.1587 Okay, from here, we know that the normal distribution graph at this part we less than 24 minus u over 6 the probability at here is 0 0.1587 Okay, now Okay, now Z less than 24 minus u over 6, right? We refract the graph to here so, 0.15x7, that means we know that if P, Z more than 24 minus U over 6 is equals to 0.15x7. Okay, from here, we want to find this. We refer to the table of normal distribution. We found that 0.15x7 is 1.00. Okay, that means... We know that P Z is greater than 1.00 equals to 0 0.15 at 7. Okay, right? Okay, now we compare. Since that we at here, we our value at here is a positive. If we deflect to here, it's become a positive value. That means the value at here is negative. So we have to put a negative 24 minus U equals to 6 equals to 1. Okay. 24 minus u equals to negative 6 u equals to 30 okay that's it we found the mean okay now we are going to do question b hence find the probability that a randomly chosen sex has wave of more than 33 kg okay x more than 33 we standardize the x, we get p z equals to 33 minus the mean. Then we found the mean is 33, 30, right? Okay, minus the mean over the standard deviation 6. Okay, calculate, we get the answer of 0 0.5. Okay, refer to the table of normal distribution. More than 0 0.5 is 0 0.3085. Okay, we get this probability so 0 0.30 at 5 okay that's it so easy okay comes to b2 find the probability that a randomly chosen will be separate okay refer to the question the sack is separate from the others if it's weight less than 25 kg code so that means we have to find the probability of sack that less than 25 kg Okay, this will be separate. Okay, standardize the x. We get z less than 25 minus 30 over 6. And we get the answer of 
0, negative 0 0.83 Okay, same like that You draw the normal distribution graph It's less than 0 0.83 You want to find the probability But since it's negative We could not find in the table Thus we have to deflect this negative 0 0.83 to the opposite side Okay, find this side So the same z more than 0 0.83 we will get the same probability refer to the graph 0 0.83 okay we will get 0 0.2033 okay this is our probability okay okay guys now we're looking for the c a total of five sec are chosen at random find the probability that all the sec are to be separate at least four of the sec are to be separate. Okay, now we know that a total of five sec are chosen at random. That means our n is equals to five. Okay, we randomly choose this five. Okay, now this is a binomial binomial distribution. X b equals to five. Then from the b question, we know that all the sec are to be separate you want we know the probability from here find the probability at random chosen will be separate so since our binomial we have to write like b equals to n p right the p we can go we can find from the b2 0 0.2033 okay back to our question 5 0 0.2033 is our probability to separate the sec Okay, now the question wants us all the sec are to be separate. That means five of five, five of the snack, all must be separate. The probability of separate the snack is 0 0.2033. Use by using the binomial formula. Probability x equals to five. We get that five c five. This is total number, and this is the sec that you want to separate okay p p is the probability of separate the sec from the others 0 0.2033 and this is how many that you want to separate okay we know that is five lah and q q is the probability that do not separate from the sec so one minus two zero three three we get that 0 0.7967 okay the R, 1 minus R. So, one min 5 minus 5, we get that is 0. Wait. Okay. N minus R, 5 minus 5, we get that 0. Okay. By using your own calculator, you'll get the answer 0 0.003473. Okay. You will get this answer. Okay. Come. Okay. We get this answer. Okay. Now. We came to the last question. At least four of the sec are to be separate. Okay, we want at least four only. So that means p x at least more or equals to four. At least four. Okay. So we know that this equal sign we can write as this equals to four plus p x equals to five. Okay. Same concept using the formula binomial formula 2033 okay how many we want four okay the failure probability seven nine six seven is one five minus four we get one plus probability of s equals to five we get it zero point zero 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 three four seven three okay we get this Okay, by calculate all the answer, we will get 0 0.007152. Okay, that's it. This is our final answer. Thank you for your watching watching our videos. Thanks. One, two, three. Thank you for watching our video. If your video is beneficial, please like, share, and subscribe. Bye. Bye. See you guys.